20,000. I want you to think about the number 20,000. Seven and a half million. Both those numbers are significant because those are related to the breaths that we take every day. We think about breathing. Do we think about breathing? We don't. It's autonomic. It automatically happens. Well, so does stress. It's unconscious. Stress, the stress response, it happens naturally. Our hormone levels increase, our sweat glands activate, our heart rate increases, and our mind goes blank. It is an evolutionary response to stress. How would you feel if you knew that you could control the stress in your life simply by taking a <coughs> breath? Stress is everywhere. It's at home, it's at the store with our parents, sometimes with our significant others at work. And when we are under stress, our nervous system is on high alert. And that is damaging to our body, our mind, and our spirit. Having those tools to relax is essential. Today I'm gonna to share with you a few relaxation techniques to help you be aware of your stress levels through your breathing, how your body feels, and where your stress is located to bring about a relaxation response. A relaxation response is beneficial in that it causes your, blood, your breathing to be a little slower, it promotes emotional health, it lowers your blood pressure, it reduces your heart rate, it even improves your immunity, it improves your focus and your mood. Wouldn't we all like to be happier? It also reduces our stress hormones and, and causes them to be less activated. The stress response is the opposite of the relaxation response. I'm Candace Freeman and I'm a behavioral health student. I've been in many classes and participated in many relaxation and stress relieving exercises. And I've learned the importance of regulating your stress response through relaxation techniques. I've participated in and I've led relaxation exercises from preschool, teaching little children how to be aware of their bodies, to retirement homes, we're teaching elderly how to relax and be calmer in a stressful environment. <coughs> and I've also seen firsthand how failing to manage your stress is detrimental to your health. Through relaxation techniques such as diaphragmatic breathing, progressive muscle relaxation, as well as massage, we can reduce our stress and increase our ability <coughs> to achieve a state of relaxation. First, we're gonna talk about diaphragmatic breathing. It involves deep breathing through the lungs to the diaphragm. It's simple, it's effective. You can do it anywhere at any time to help you relax and reduce your stress. It slows your heart rate, it reduces your feelings of anxiety, and it improves and increases your feelings of groundedness and your ability to focus through this deep breathing exercise. One example I'd like to present is called box breathing. Box breathing is, as you, it's all sides, even though this is a rectangle, and you breathe in through your nose for four seconds, hold it in for four seconds, breathe out through your mouth for four seconds, and then hold for four seconds before trying it again. In the process, you feel the breathing through your lungs extend throughout your body, and it helps you relieve your stress, reduce your anxiety, let your fears go, let your worries go out with each exhalation and all those concerns that you may have leave. Along with that, there is progressive muscle relaxation. It's also known as body scan. This is the ability to check in with yourself, to make yourself aware how your body feels, and notice without judgment, without having any preconceived notion about what you should be feeling or how you should be relating, where your stress is, where your tension is, where you have aches, and where um, other sensations are located. Body scan systematically shifts your focus and attention from all the external troubles in the world to what is going on from your head to your toes. With a body scan, you begin by getting comfortable. You find a quiet, safe space. You begin by warming up and taking three slow, deep breaths. 
calming your thoughts and being present in the moment. You start at either your head or your toes and focus on how it feels. How does that part feel? Is it tight? Is it loose? Is it warm? Is it tingly? By then, you move on uh, to creating an awareness about yourself and you move to the next body part. So if you started at your toes, you'll move to your feet and your ankles, and then up to your shin and your calves, focusing on each area of your body and being mindful about what's going on, drawing attention to your whole body as you are doing this. Some individuals visualize <coughs> a golden light radiating from their core out or a warmth spreading out from their core to their fingers and their toes. When you come back to yourself, what do you hear? Open your eyes, wiggle your body, and begin to feel your sensations again. Body scans is a beneficial, mindful practice that helps reduce your anxiety, decrease your pain, improve in your decision-making. It also lowers your stress levels, builds self-discipline, and grounds you, all through focusing and um, leaving you re-energized, relaxed, and ready. The last relaxation techniques I'd like to focus on is um, massage. It incorporates diaphragmatic breathing as well as a body awareness. There are many types of massage, sports and deep tissue, relieve muscle problems and heal injuries. Reflexology and Swedish massage both promote relaxation and improve circulation. Swedish massage was developed in Sweden by Per Heinrich Ling, a physiologist and a gymnast, gymnastic instructor. It's practiced globally by many in the um, health industry. Swedish massage uses long flowing strokes, kneading motions, and circular movements. It also performed by a licensed massage therapist with training in massage. The aim is to relax the entire body and improve circulation by reducing our stress and promoting relaxation. Massage therapy is a part of the relaxation techniques, including progressive muscle relaxation and diaphragmatic breathing. These are effective tools in managing our stress. In our life, we have a variety of stressors, but there are just as many ways to achieve relaxation. Think about it, 20,000, 20,000 breaths, 20,000 times we have to focus on being present 20,000 times we can control our stress. 20,000 ways to find ways to reduce our stress. It's just the tip of the iceberg. Find one that you enjoy, that brings you peace, that alleviates the chaos in your world, and we can achieve a relaxed state by consciously breathing, being aware of our bodies, and focusing on feeling at peace with us. <coughs> Thank you.